morning. Today we are back with the Independence of the Seas cruise series. The series is starting right now. It is April the 24th. I'm here this morning. Mama Holcomb, there she is, say good morning. How are you? It is a bright and early 8.30 in the morning, 8.28 to be exact, and uh, we've just got everything packed up. I have got the drone, ladies and gentlemen. I've got the drone with me, and we're gonna be taking that down. As you guys know, we did the pre-cruise breakdown uh, last week, and we're gonna be heading down to beautiful Cozumel, Mexico on this four-day Caribbean, Western Caribbean cruise vacation aboard the beautiful Independence of the Seas, the newly renovated. Independence of the Seas. Uh, if you guys haven't seen yet, they've got the new Perfect Storm water slide park thing on it. It's also got the sky pad, which I have not gotten an email about yet that it's not that it's not open. So cross our fingers, cross our fingers, it'll be open and we'll be able to uh, enjoy that and uh, check that out. If not though, we are supposed to be getting a ship tour from one of Royal Caribbean's fine PR personnel on board. So uh, that will be loads of fun. I'm sure they'll show us the sky pad at least. Oh, yeah. So we'll get to at least see it. And tons of other fun for you guys. As you know, my friend Peter is joining us on it. So he's actually probably already made his way to the airport or making his way right now to the airport. He's gonna be boarding his flight <laughs> from a whopping Orlando to Fort Lauderdale. He's gonna be like, wheels up, wheels down. There we go, there we are. <laughs> There's Fort Lauderdale, but uh, Nonetheless, it actually would have been cheaper for him to fly than to park his car at the port and like drive and with the gas mileage and everything. So he's just gonna end up actually uh, flying. The flight was like, I think 50 or 60 bucks. So um, he, he definitely got a deal and a steal on that one. But hey. Peter, he's, he's known for that. He's yeah. Mr. Uh, coupon man himself, just like me. <laughs> for real, for real. He is, uh, if there's a deal, Peter will find it. So we're gonna get out right now. Uh, gonna head out and uh, start this am amazing, beautiful, vacation going down to Fort Lauderdale today Cozumel on Saturday the independence of the seas tomorrow let's get it this rolling. guy is going to be the driver this morning taxi extraordinaire five dollars a mile <laughs> You guys already know we got the Chick-fil-A. It was it was a given. I didn't need to I didn't need to say anything. On to Robin. I didn't know what I was talking about with the whole, you know, Chick-fil-A thing. It's kind of like a tradition for us. I think it's a tradition, yeah. We've done it now, I don't know. I think pretty much every cruise since the I know we did it, even me and you and the glory. Yeah. But it's yeah. just kind of uh <clears throat> unless we're you know unless we're flying out on Sunday, it's kind of like a, a crew cruise day or travel day tradition for us to go to Chick-fil-A. I love that company. It's a great business, great food, um, and it's a great great meal to start off vacation. Uh, tonight, when we get to Fort Lauderdale, Peter and I are actually staying in the Hilton Marina, um, which is, I don't know if you guys are familiar with, you know, Fort Everglades and everything, but it's literally right next to where Princess Cruise Line docks. So, um, we should have views of the cruise ship in the morning, and uh, if any of you are sailing out tonight, we should have views of those as well. So it should be a fun time there. We're gonna probably head over to Fort Lauderdale Beach this afternoon and spend just an hour or two over there and then have dinner somewhere, maybe either on Fort Lauderdale Beach or actually uh, they have a water taxi that comes right outside of our hotel. So we might go and get on that and um, you know just cruise around, see what restaurants we can get up to, what fun. Well, that might just have been the worst parking situation we have ever encountered here at RDU. I mean, we have never been down here. This is like, what would you call this? Yeah, we are in like the the bottom of the of the bottom. We're under the airport right now. Oh yeah. My goodness, so busy here today in RDU. Good great. Bye, I love you. Bye, Dad. <laughs> All right, Fort Lauderdale, here we come. Right, 
made it through TSA, about 40 minutes to spare. I think I'm gonna find a restroom, maybe find some coffee, get to my gate, get ready to head down to Fort Lauderdale. Peter should actually just be arriving in Fort Lauderdale. What's up and good morning guys, it's Peter. I am here at Orlando International Airport heading to Fort Lauderdale. I am currently all checked in, got my bag dropped off, about to go through TSA. My flight's only to, to Fort Lauderdale, which is a 45 minute flight, so it's like a jump, skip, and a hop away. Let's head through TSA and go meet Josh. Hotel does not have a shuttle, right? No, so we have to take a uh, Uber. Check it out. It is nice. All right, Mr. Peter, here we are. Look at this. It does have a balcony. Nice. So, oh, let's get in here. Check it out. Wow. Do you believe that? <gasps> this is literally perfect. <laughs> Look. It is, how do you open this? Oh my gosh, there we go. <gasps> Look. Wow. <laughs> we have a view of the cruise ships. They knew. <laughs> yeah, this is perfect. Absolutely perfect. So like our ship will be right there tomorrow. Yeah. Tomorrow morning we're gonna wake oh, up and awesome. boom shakalaka, there it awesome. is. I love it. There it is. There we are guys, we are here, we've made it to the Hilton uh, Fort Lauderdale Marina. Mr. Peter has joined us once again. Yes. Back for another cruise vacation. <laughs> you know, it was all crazy back there in the airport, so we did like a half introduction oh, back yeah. there for That's you. True. So there he is, he's here. He's Hi. joining us today. Like and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> Extra magic, one word. There you go, Thank there you, you go. There's his little Love YouTube you channel. He does um, <laughs> Disney, 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 and more Disney, except for when he's blacked out with his annual pass. Then he does Universal. Then he does Universal. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> universal. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I think we're gonna get settled in. Let me show you guys this room really quick. This is like really, really, it's such a nice room. Yeah. And I was just telling Peter, the customer service has been phenomenal so far. Like yes. we were downstairs and I'm like a Hilton Honors member. And so like they had a little sign that was like, oh, we have com 
compliment your Wi-Fi for you. And so I just asked about it. He was like, I was like, you know, like I'm a Hilton Honors member. Like you need my number and everything. He's like, oh no, I'll just give it to you. Yeah. Like they just gave us the the Wi-Fi and everything. Yeah, he was very and, knowledgeable about the yeah. whole area. Yeah. Like he knew the whole area and he was giving us recommendations. Recommendations. For food. So because that's what we're gonna do right now. Yes. <laughs> we are starving. We are starving. I've not had anything since Chick Fil A this morning. I don't oh. know about what did you have. Have I you had not had anything? Butter and jelly sandwich on the plane. That's yummy, <laughs> yummy. So we're gonna head downstairs. They have like a restaurant here. What do you call it? The G bar? The G something, yeah. Yeah, something, the, the G something. <laughs> the G something. So we're gonna head down and uh, check that out, see about uh, having lunch there. If not there, he said right up here on 17th Street, there's like literally 50, 50 to 100 restaurants. So we'll head up there and find something yummy before we head over and hang out on the afternoon on Fort Lauderdale Beach. Yeah. I'm excited. Maybe you'll actually so get in this excited. time. Oh, I'm definitely getting in. <laughs> I'm a new person though. <laughs> oh, is it a bottle pool? Whoa. <laughs> oh, what did we just step into? <laughs> oh my god. Like we just stepped into like a movie or something. <laughs> I mean it though. Look at this. Wow. This is literally insane. Oh my gosh. You could like bring your boat here and dock here and stay at this hotel. Yeah. Oh, here's the pool. Updated. Yeah. So it says you can bring 12 standard 17 ounce cans. Per person or per cabin? Uh, per state room. Per state room, huh. So we were just looking up uh, the uh, like the the carry on beverage policies for um, Royal Caribbean. Uh, basically decided if we want to go out and get like, you know, like a case of Coke tonight. And I think we should. I mean, if we can bring it on, why not, yeah. right? That's the key. Right. Yeah. And that'll like, that way we won't have to pay the onboard prices for it, at least for those first six, you know? Right. So right. yeah, why not? Why not? Um, we did decide to eat here at the G, what is it called? The G Bar and Grill. That's what it is. The G Bar and Grill. Yeah. Um, so they have cocktails on the back, so I'll let you guys, you can pause the video if you want to take a look at that. Um, and then here's the full menu. And again, you can pause and take a look at that if you like. Um, but literally, I mean, right there's our hotel. Right here. This is our hotel. Right it's here, really nice. all this. Yeah, and we're right here. So I think the convenience factor is really what did it for us yeah, today. Yeah, we didn't feel like walking. Yeah, we just didn't feel like we're just starving to death. <laughs> it's three o'clock, so we just want something to eat. Um, so we're gonna split something. Just not sure what yet. We gotta make some decisions. Afternoon. It's 3:30. Yeah, it's our late, 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 late lunch slash uh, dinner, dinner, dinner tighter over. Is that a word? <laughs> pre dinner, pre dinner. Yeah, our pre dinner dinner. <laughs> um, but it came with uh, the five chicken tenders, and then we added the fries for three dollars on the side there. And it looks absolutely it looks scrumptious. Yes, yes, they do. I can't wait to dig in. Let's do it. I'm tired of talking. We are done, out of here. Finished, finito. It was excellent. I really, really enjoyed it. The quality, the quality of the food is really nice too. Like everything was really homemade. Homemade fries, homemade chicken, hand battered, <laughs> hand breaded chicken. It's really, really nice. Look at this pool. Super relaxing. Yeah, it is, it is. I was just gonna say that I feel very relaxed, very, you know. It's very nice. We're gonna um, walk up here to the waterfront, see if we can find the water taxi prices. So, um, Fort Lauderdale has like a water taxi that that you know goes along the canals and marina and stuff, and it actually stops at this hotel. So, we want to try and see where it stops, other otherwise, right. and how much it is, so that we can kind of you know, so we can see if we need to do that or an Uber, you know, to get around later on this afternoon and tonight. Are they like? They're like they're like building it. Not building it. They're like fixing it. It looks brand new. Yeah. Wow. They're like fixing it up. Look at that one. Yeah. Oh my goodness, Peter! Where have we come <laughs> to? Hey, we stepped in the my city over God, here. it's beautiful down here. One can dream, can't he? 
fun day. My Oh look, goodness. it's called Zoom Zoom Zoom. This one? Yeah. Zoom Zoom Zoom. <laughs> Love it. How cute. I don't know that this is the way for the I think the water tracks may be the other way. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I am doing something wrong right now. Like <laughs> This is not okay. That we're we're literally walking like I could literally touch. You can climb on a multi-million million dollar yacht. <laughs> like we're talking hundreds of feet long, like holding like I don't know how many people. Like this, it's literally insane, literally insane. And we're just like walking. Oh, is that crabs? There's fish in there. Oh yeah. You see them? Yeah. Huh. I don't know. I don't know. Where? Yeah. Ella Ash. Wow, look at that. Look at this. You got some power in that boat, my gosh. So we actually stopped by the concierge desk on our way back up here to the room and uh, they had a water taxi uh, brochure on it and it's got like, Peter can you help me out just a second. It's got, so it's got the map of uh, everywhere that the water taxi stops. So we are, uh, where are we, we're here, right? Uh, yes. Yeah, here for uh, Riverside Hotels. And then there's a uh, beach access. Oh wait, no, we're heel to Marina right here. So uh, there's beach access right here at number five. So we're stopped four and number five. So uh, yeah, I think uh, the only thing that we have questions about is like the fare it says is eighteen dollars and it has a happy hour after five p.m. Um, but we're wondering is that like one way is that for the rest of today is that round trip you know like so we just want to go down i'm thinking actually it's probably going to be for the rest of the day because why would they drop the price at 5 p.m right exactly 5 to 9 p.m is only to use it yeah so we need to find that out but in in, in any regard we're going to get changed up and head over it's time next time it's not bad at all it's just shy of numbing a thousand more times i love what kind of food we can get into spontaneousness has just occurred gosh i'm doing it i'm doing it i am oh my goodness don't vlog in bolt it's so dangerous All right.